there. So, today I am feeling much better than when I did the last vlog experiment thingy. And since some of you have presented some interest in the items that are in my room, I'm going to ask you what would you like to to see what in a video what would you like me to make a video about I mean I can make a video let's see interesting things uh, my stereo system which is pretty much all of this including my turntable this Toshiba uh, satellite 4000 CDS laptop right here which I do use regularly <laughs> um, I don't know my Polaroid 635 camera although there's not much to talk about about this thing not much to talk about this thing why did, did I say about twice there? I have no clue um, I don't know I have a an IBM E server something here just one new server it's been mostly harvested for parts but it works so I could make a video about that my main computer right here which is in a really long case and doesn't feature an optical drive it's pretty much empty and it has dual Xeons and 8 gigs of fully buffered DDR2 RAM and a 40 gigabyte hard drive. I could make a video about this Power Mac G4, which be, has been fully upgraded to an FX 5500 graphics card, dual 500 megahertz uh, processors, um, uh, USB 2.0 card, and a SATA card, which it boots from. It has an 80 gigabyte SATA disk drive. I don't know, I could make a video about that Power Mac G3 right there, the, that beige Power Mac G3 which has been upgraded to its full 768 megabytes of RAM and that's about it and I have uh, a beta of OS 10 and OS 10.0, 10.1 and 10.2 and 10.3 installed in it. I could make a video about uh, my Laserdisc player uh, whenever uh, Wayne's, Wor Wayne's World arrives, that is, because all I have are just documentaries right there, which has been have been transferred from a VHS for the looks of them. I could make a video about my whole retro setup with my Super Nintendo and my NES and my N64 and my Wii, which isn't that retro, but whatever. I could make a video about my server, well, uh, I actually can't because it is doing its job and I cannot take it out of there. So it would be a very superficial video. I could make a video, I don't know, about the Mega Drive? There's a lot of videos about Mega Drives out there, so yeah, you know everything, you can know everything about a Mega Drive. Um, I don't know. I don't see more things, more interesting things that I could make videos about. Oh, right. My red. Whoopsie. My camera just fell. Thankfully, this, these things are built like tanks. Um, my retro computer right here. I use this for retro gaming, even though it is unplugged, completely unplugged. It has a 166 MHz Pentium MMX in there, 96 megabytes of EDO RAM, 72 pen sims, um, I don't know, dual floppies, and these awesome, like, Tri-Max uh, CD-ROM drive right here, this 52X with a turbo button right in there uh, I don't know I could make a video about my IBM Selectric 3 this is an IBM correcting Selectric 3 which I got for 10 bucks not bad at all 
Um, I don't know. There's a lot of junk in here that I could make videos about. This. Whoopsie, something else fell. Oh, that's the battery. That's the extra battery that I have. This is the extra battery that I, that I actually have for that laptop because I do take that laptop outside. That is the laptop that I take outside because, well, it works as a laptop. My T60, I use a T61 inside. Well, I used to use. I, I have pretty much forgotten about it. But uh, that one actually holds a charge. The battery that's left in there that's right now in there can hold about two hours charge this one not so much this one just half an hour it's almost dead but hey I could make a video about this little laptop right here which is an oddity I haven't found any anything about it on the internet this is an ad line by APL no ad line by ADL laptop let me has dual hooks. Um, yeah, it's a 486 laptop, which opens like in a similar fashion to the to the ThinkPad 760 line. It opens up like that, and yeah, I could make a video about this thing. It has a 64. A uh, tone monochrome display and a really, really, really crappy keyboard and the fresh install of uh, MS DOS 6.2 and Windows 3.1 on its 500 megabyte hard drive. Um, what else? I don't know. Cassette tapes. I have made videos about, about cassette tapes. All the cassette tapes that you know are there, and all of these are just. Well, they're nothing special. I could make a video about my records. Hey, my record collection, which isn't that big, but hey, it's something. My laser, I could make a video about my Laserdisc collection, although these are all in Spanish. These are all documentaries in Spanish. And these actually are in original. In the original version, as you can see here, we have rear window. Uh, but uh, even they, they are dual language. They use one channel. Since these movies are mono, they use one channel as the Spanish version and the other one as the original version. Hmm, I don't know what else I could make a video about. I just wanna make videos and I don't know what to make them about. I was thinking of making a video about my stereo but that would be too long. I pro I'd probably cut that in two or three parts. Uh, one for each component or one for each set of components like uh, reproduction systems for example. Um, and I'd make a video about my turntable, my little mini disc player, my CD player and my tape deck and then an amplifier and equalizer video and I talk about those and and a video about my tuner and yeah I I mean considering I have to take all of this stuff out to make videos about it so it's not the easiest thing in the world wow nine minutes I've been rambling for nine minutes Already, oh, I already have. I all also have. Wow, my English is really my English is really poor today. Mm, I don't know what I have eaten that has made my English so bad. I also have a, a Hameg HM604 oscilloscope right there. Although I don't have any probes or anything, so I can make a video about that one too. Yeah, just ask. Just ask. I mean, that's it. I'm asking you what I should make a video about, and you tell me. Now that I have, like, I have checked and I have 21 subscribers, which is 2 subscribers more than yesterday. 
which is pretty freaking cool actually so yeah bye and you know I love you all and bye